Hey guys, it's Laura Lily, and today I'm here to react to the second Wonder Woman official trailer. Um, I'm so excited for this. Um, I was one of those poor unfortunate souls that went and watched Batman vs Superman um, the night it came out. Um, I went with friends, which was fun, but it was Batman vs Superman, and can we all just agree that that movie was just not not good. It's, mm, from a storytelling standpoint, it was just bad. Um, from an acting standpoint, some of it was just bad. And I really felt that that entire movie's saving grace was really Wonder Woman. Um, and I'm so excited that they're making a Wonder Woman movie. Um, I feel like we need more female superheroes out there. And by out there, I mean not just in comic books, I mean made a movie to the movies for the public. I was one of the people campaigning for forever for Black Widow to have her own movie, which they kind of just completely threw out the window. Um, and so far DC seems to be, um, the like the only thing DC's beating Marvel at right now is their inclusion of uh, females in standalone movies, um, because, not that I don't love the females in Marvel, I love Black Widow, I love Peggy Carter, I love, love Scarlet Witch, but, um, they aren't getting their own movies. I mean, Agent Carter's show got, uh, cut after two seasons, and that really, really pissed me off. Um, but, um, but yeah, DC seems to be better at it. They have Wonder Woman, and they've announced that Harley Quinn, even though she's not a hero, she's going to have her own standalone movie, which I think is amazing because I love Harley. She's a great character. Um, and yeah, just in general, I think there need to be more standalone female movies, you know, not that there's, that's any of my business, but. Anyway, I love Gal Gadot's portrayal of Wonder Woman. Um, I love Wonder Woman herself. Let's just watch this shit, okay? <laughs> Let's go. I used to want to save the world. This beautiful place. But the closer you get, the more you see the great darkness within. What war? The war to end all wars. Weapons far deadlier than you can ever imagine. The war can be ours. Whoever you are, you are in more danger than you think. I cannot stand by while innocent lives are lost. Be careful, Diana. Who is this woman? She's my um, secretary, sir. <laughs> She's a very good secretary. <laughs> it is our sacred duty to defend the world, and it's what I'm going to do. Yes. You do not need to worry about that. <laughs> I 
love her theme! How can a woman possibly fight in this? Fight? We use our principles. Although, I am not opposed to engaging in a bit of fisticuffs should the occasion arise. <laughs> I love her too. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Oh. Yeah, no. Diana Prince is a strong, independent woman who not only don't need no man, um, she repeatedly tells men she does not need their help, which I am all for. I love it. Um, I loved it with Peggy Carter, how she was, how like, everyone expected her to be just this feminine little woman secretary or whatever and she just went out and kicked ass on her own and didn't need anyone's help um and Wonder Woman's just the same and that's I think that's why I love both of them so much um oh I can't wait for this movie to come out I'm probably gonna go see it the night it comes out and oh man so excited Oh man, I don't have much else to say. That was that was amazing. <laughs> Wonder Woman is amazing. Their portrayal of her in this is amazing. And ah, oh, I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't. I gotta go. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. I love you all so much and I hope to see you soon. Love you guys. Bye.